I'm going to log in as a regular user and I'm going to create a new collaboration site. I'll click on Sites, Create Site. Maybe this will be a site that the product launch team will use to collaborate on product launches. So I'll give it a name, product launch, and a description. Now I have to decide the visibility for this project. Public, moderated, or private. Moderated just means that people have to ask to join. Private means no one will know that this site exists. I'll make it a public site. Now I've got a site that only I belong to, so I need to invite more people to collaborate with me on this site. I'll search for some people to add. Let's add the first four users that pop up. And we're going to leave this fifth user off for a second. Now I need to decide which role each of these users will have. Let's give the first user manager rights, the next two collaborator, and the final one consumer. If I wanted to set them all to the same role, I could do that here. This looks good, so let's click invite. Now those invites have gone out, which means emails have gone out to those users to let them know they've been invited to a site. I'll go ahead and log out. Let's flip over and pretend that we are test user 1 and look at test user 1's email. Looks like there's a new message that has arrived and it's an invitation from Jeff Potts to join the product launch site. If I click this accept link I'll be added as a member to the site. Let's log in. And I can see that I'm now a member of the site. We'll get rid of this helper thing here. And now I can see uh, that Jeff Potts and Test User One are both managers of the site. If I click Members and Pending Invites, I can see that test users 2, 3, and 4 have not yet accepted their invitations. If I wanted to cancel those invitations, I could do that here. Let's log out and log in as test user 5. That's the user we neglected to invite to the site. Because the site is public, test user 5 can do a search. And as long as that user knows what the site is called, the site can be found, and because it's public, they can join the site. And when you join the site like that, you'll be joining as a consumer. So it would take a manager to come back later and give you uh, a higher permission level if that's what you needed.